Hey, what's up? You guys, I'm back. This is Gas and we're coming for some Christmas money. So I have a lineup of a lot of people that have submitted all of their loot. And you guys, every single clip in here is over a million, or at least a million. A million and up. Just in time for the Christmas season. And of course, you guys, this is going to be a two-part series. Now, if you don't see your name in here, I have a lot of submissions. But unfortunately, you guys, uh, I just have too many that I can't post. So I'm only going to do uh, just the highest loots that I see. So if you have a million and up, you will be in here. Honorable mentions for you. Thank you so much for submitting. Hopefully you guys had a great Christmas. But if you didn't, then this video is for you. I got lots of loot to give to you. Check it out. This is my top five where we get lots of money and high level gameplays coming into place, you guys. So sit back, relax, and let me show you all the cool gameplay up here. All right, you guys, coming in at number five, it's Vincats from Skybiz. And isn't it a coincidence? He found a Christmas base. Someone's welcoming him into the loot. He doesn't mind it. You can take my gold, but you will never take my... Well, okay, you will. You've taken everything. He's taken all his stuff, but it's okay. It's Christmas. Thank you so much, Mr. Loose Kid. You're in the right spirit. <laughs> Okay, coming in at number four is uh, Guy Fat Guy 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 <laughs> from War Pigs, and he's got his balloon attack. Now, you guys, if you notice, there's not a lot of loot in this video. Uh, that's not the reason why this is making it onto my number four. There is lots of dark elixir. In fact, that's the most dark elixir I've seen. I've probably seen uh, 500. Wait, wait, wait 5,600. Uh, but this guy came in. And he's got 7,000 Dark Elixir. Now that's quite a bit that I've seen. I'm not sure how much the, the record is, but 7,000 is the highest I've seen so far. So I'm going to have to look around and see if anything's higher than that. But I can tell you from experience, you will find lots of loot and especially lots of Dark Elixir on max bases like this in Champions League and high cup levels if you're looking to farm up there. So thank you so much, Mr. Gafilabile. And for more pigs, yeah. All right, you guys, coming in at number three is Red Wings 12 from the War or Boot. And he's using the Balloonians attack. See, that's what I love about Balloonians. You can use them for high level play and farming gameplay. So that's what a lot of people are using up here. They're using the Balloonians just to get that loot. And I'm not sure if this is a Town Hall 10 in Crystal or Champions because I can't see his shield, but he's throwing all of his resources outside. So I'm thinking he's pushing to get cups. He doesn't really care about loot. Uh, but that works in favor for lots of farmers that are looking to uh, farm in those high cup ranges. He's found a nice base, giving him way over a million, getting that loot. Almost got a three star, but he couldn't make it. There's too many weapons guarding that town hall. He got his queen working her magic, only a level 10. He got his level 10 heroes doing their thing. So that goes to show you how strong the Balloonia team is. Good stuff making it on my top five. All right, kicking it off for our number two spot, it's In Famous from Plunder Legends. I can't really make out a lot of the gameplay in this video because it's recorded with a phone, recording a phone, I believe. So even though it's not high quality, the money's still good, you guys, and that's my policy. I like the money, and it's uh, made it onto my number two spot. And so he's using uh, pretty decent troops with only one hero. He doesn't have a queen, and he's still pulling it off. So my guess is he was in... Uh, gold three and he's a town hall seven town hall seven or eight and so he's got his level 10 hero going in taking out all of the uh, barracks and cannons out on the outside his troops are just working their way around and you guys he's pushing his way to get to the last that three star victory he's got it and made it onto my number two spot thank you so much infamous Okay, coming in at number one is Oliver Guy from Slap My Alpaca. <laughs> so you guys, a moment of silence will be given to this attack. 
I do want to mention, however, there was somebody with 2 million that they submitted to me, but it was just a picture. So please keep in mind, you guys, if you record your gameplay, it will make it onto my number one. If it's a picture, it'll be in my honorable mentions. So the runner up is this guy, Oliver Guy. So let's watch what he can do. Alright you guys, so that's my top 5, make sure you check out part 2 coming soon, this is Gasson doing my top 5 raids, Merry Christmas and I will see you guys next time, Gasson out.